everybody and welcome to Oakland A's Baseball here in NBC Sports California. I'm Glenn Kuyper joined by my two broadcast partners as always Ray Fossey and Dallas Braden. Guys let's get right to this pitching matchup because it certainly has a chance to be an interesting one. Fires coming off his great year. Otani well, they've been waiting a long time to see him pitch they be in the Angels. Ray what are you looking for today? Well I'm looking forward to the Sunday pitcher for the Angels named Shohei Otani and that's basically what he's going to be doing. I, I think the interesting thing for him because this is his first start and as you mentioned, he has not pitched in 22 months. Last year, he was able to hit, so we'll see how he pitches. But how would you like to have a number three starter with 15 wins being your rotation? That's what the A's are featuring today in Mike Fires. He pitched the no-hitters, a no-hitter last year. He had a five-inning start, and then he ran off 13 consecutive games in which he pitched at least six innings. I think that's what you're talking about in a leader. You can save the bullpen. Mike Fires has an assortment of pitches to be able to throw at the Angels, and I think we're going to see all of those today against a very good hitting lineup. Dallas, let's get back to Otani. I think all eyes are going to be on him today. A saw him two years ago. He pitched twice against him, and man, he was terrific. Oh, no doubt, Kai, and they are going to have their hands full today with Showtime Sunday himself, Shohei Otani, who had his way with the Oakland A's, as you mentioned, a couple different times last year. More importantly, that second game, that was in Anaheim back on April 8th, and he was dazzling. He was perfect into the seventh inning, ended up completing seven innings of one hit, 12 punch out baseball, and that's all due in part to a good fastball located all around the zone and that devastating split finger fastball. So look for the Oakland A's to zone him up, be patient, and try to get something up to handle. All right, Fires and Otani, the pitching matchup. Each team has won a game in this series. A couple more games to play. We're looking forward to it. Should be a fun day of baseball here at the Coliseum. Below. There's a few changes in each team's lineup today. Here is the starting lineup for the Angels. Fletcher, Trout, Listella. Listella up to the third spot. Upton, Jared Walsh gets a start. Simmons, Castro, Matt Theis. Young left-handed hitters, the DH, and Brian Goodwin is in right field. So Albert Pools gets a day off. And Mike Fires uh, making his first start of the 2020 campaign, and I, I think from his standpoint, he is due to be a free agent after this season. So I think from the A's getting a chance to see him and whatever starts they're going to get out of him is a plus. He's a very good pitcher, assortment of pitches, curveball. I mean, he'll mix them up. He's not overpowering with his fastball, but I think the biggest thing for him, he will throw any pitch at any time, and that's what makes him so good that he's one of the rare pitchers in Major League Baseball to have multiple no-hitters. Here's the A's defense today. Grossman's in left, Laureano's in center. Mark Canna starts today in right field. Chapman, Simeon, Kemp, and Olsen around the infield with Sean Murphy doing the catching. And here is their lineup. A few changes today. Marcus Simeon is at short. Ramon Laureano's in center. Matt Chapman's at third. Matt Olsen at first. Then Canna's in right, Grossman in left. Famiel Machine gets his first start. In fact, it'll be his major league debut. He's a left-handed hitter, and he's the designated hitter. And then Sean Murphy and Tony Kemp at the bottom of the lineup. And Shohei Otani on the mound for the Angels. And again, I think the biggest thing to look at the velocity, look at the splitter, look at all of his pitches, and just see how efficient he is with those today. Basically, he is fastball, curveball, and a split. And if the split is working, the fastball, he could pitch in the upper 90s when healthy and when the fastball is working well. Of course, the splitter is outstanding. And behind Otani today, the Angels will line up with Upton, Trout, and Goodwin in the outfield. Fletcher, Simmons, La Stella, and Walsh, third to first. And Castro is your catcher. 